Hello, my name is Asma Bufridi, and I'm a postdoctoral scientist at the Skytis Institute for Drug Discovery at Griffith University. My research focuses on discovering new medicines from nature, in particular for Parkinson's disease. Nature is a wonderful resource of potential medicines. Here at the Skytis Institute, our researchers and their collaborators have been collecting samples from nature for over 20 years. The samples now form a truly unique collection called Nature Bank compressing over 63,000 samples of plant and marine invertebrates. This is where researchers like me come in. I can now take these samples from nature and try to discover new medicines from major human diseases, like Parkinson's, the focus of my research. My research focuses on using chemical compounds from nature to develop new medicines for Parkinson's disease. To do this, I take solutions containing chemicals from plant and marine organisms and test them in the laboratory to see if they can improve the growth of cells donated by patients with Parkinson's disease. When I find a sample that enhances the survival of these cells, I then investigate what kind of chemical is present using proton anamar. Then I isolate each compound using various experimental procedures and retest them in the laboratory to see which ones contain the ability to cause enhanced Parkinson's cell growth. It's a bit like being detective. And when I find what I'm looking for, it can be very exciting. The next step in these studies is to try to figure out how the chemical acts on the Parkinson's cells to determine if we can develop this compound as a possible new medicine. Today, I've told you a little bit about my own research, but the benefits of Nature Bank itself extend beyond my project. For instance, other compounds discovered from our natural samples may also be useful for other diseases, like malaria and cancer. We want to ensure that for the next 150 years, researchers can access this fantastic bank of plant and marine material. I'm really proud to be working on a project that may span generations. It's such an exciting opportunity to honor Steve's legacy and look at the next 150 years of testing these samples to try to find treatments and cures for some of the diseases that affect humankind. I'm really proud to be part of this process and working with the Ascitis Institute.